everyone. Mac is back. Today uh, I want to talk about the uh, Alliance Mobilization Rewards and uh, which, which ones that uh, we probably uh, should be accepting or we should be getting based on you know what, the, what your options are. Some are better than others. Um, some are more toward you know geared toward certain players and others. So it, yours, what I suggest may not be exactly what you want to uh, you know what you want to accept but or what you want to pick. But uh, at the same time, there are some that are uh, pretty obvious that you do and don't want to pick. So uh, let's get to it. Okay, so here we are, and we're just start from number one. We'll go the whole way down, just kind of explaining one by one. Uh, so the very first one, we have 600 diamonds, we have 12 hours of research speed up, and we have eight hours of just uh, regular speed up. So um, in this case, if you're going for the speed ups. Uh, I would say, you know, 12 hours is better than 8 hours. This can be used for anything. This can only be used for research. Um, you're, if you're, you know, you're, everybody's probably past the, you know, has their, all their buildings at level 25. If you do not have your buildings level 25, then, you know, this could be, you know, a little more valuable to you, but um, you're, you're probably going to want the research there if that's what you're going for. Um, 600 diamonds is very good too. This, um, if you're trying to buy those epic tokens, uh, then this is definitely the, the one that you're going to want to get. You know, if you want to stack up through as we go down, you'll see more diamonds. And by the time you do it, yeah, before you know it, at the end, you may even have enough to, uh, to buy, you know, for one day's worth. Uh, well, it just depends, you know. Um, second one you're looking at, uh, you can get gold pretty much anywhere, and uh, the 75% boots are, are, are nice if you're free to play. Um, actually, it doesn't really matter. You're probably going to be taking the infantry uh, attack badge, and that's really nice for a level two. You usually don't see that uh, level, this uh, uh, this low of a level. Usually, they're up a little bit further. So, uh, the attack badge is pretty much what you're going to do. And and if you're if you're a spear uh, cav or cav spear formation, you know this is less valuable to you. But um, you know when they're giving away giving away free badges, and these are more difficult to get, um, you can get gold anywhere, and you're going to get the the boots a lot of places too. So definitely. Uh, Infantry badge, infantry attack badge, and then the same thing goes here. You have a little bit more of a, you know, of a thought to think about getting the diamonds instead of the badges, but the badges are are, are more difficult to get, um, and you can get diamonds every day from your alliance and from the training grounds and uh, you know different places like that, rebel groups and rebel leaders. So uh, the attack badge there is what you're going to want as well. Moving to the next one, um, it's nice to have these these 24 hour. Uh, you know, protect bubbles. Again, you can you can kind of buy you buy you, you can buy those. Oh, you can actually get all of these, but uh, that's and they give you two of them. <clears throat> so if you are free to play, this probably is pretty good for you. Um, my thought is I, that the motivation is is pretty good because you can attack those rebel leaders and upgrade your equipment a little bit. Um, I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't say no to if you're gonna if you're going for all the diamonds too, because right now we're looking if you got those diamonds, six times three is eighteen. That's eighteen hundred diamonds already. So that's uh, that's pretty significant as well. Uh, moving down to the next one, these we can get the marks of the dragon killing, um, you know, killing those dragon layers. So I don't go for those. Vi VIP is a very very long process to upgrade. Not worth it. The precise transfers are very um, uh, much more rare in this game. So I would suggest getting that. Don't worry about the meat. Um, again, speed ups versus diamonds. I'm probably still going diamonds because you're going to get speed ups along the way as well. And this one, this see, this one's a little bit, a little bit different. Um, again, you're not going for the meat again. I would probably go for the spirit of the weirwood. You can collect those, and then you can blitz those, and be able to get those elite tokens and upgrade those commanders. And then you also have the uh, the gold dragons over here, which again, you you get you get gold pretty easily. Um, and then looking at these three here, you're probably getting the speed ups at this point. Um, again, if we're looking at, if we're talking about free-to-play players, uh, it's a little, it might be a little bit different. You're not getting these badges even free-to-play, and free-to-play, if you don't have a farm or you don't have a bank or something like that, then I can understand wanting to get, wanting to get the gold. You know, that would make a little bit of sense, but at the same time, I think I'm still going to get the speed-ups and either mine for gold or get a farm or something like that as well. Uh, the next one, you have a, ba uh, you know, you have a badge chest that's going to give you common to rare. You have the uh, elite tokens and you have the speed up. So you're not going to go with the speed ups. You're probably going to go with a badge or the elite uh, general token. I, you know, I, there's been, you know, I don't want to say controversy, but there's been, you know, do you want to have a, a badge chest of random quality that could be total crap, or do you want a, an elite token you know you're going to use and you know you can get? And it's only one, but again, it's only one badge too. So I'm going to go with a guarantee here. 
and, and and more of the safer bet if you want to risk it you know that's that's up totally up to you of course um, then you have defense badges you know if you're if you're a cavalry front line this is going to be this would be very nice to get for me i'm probably going to go for the 1200 diamonds to try to get my uh, epic tokens and moving down more kind of the same thing here i'm probably going to go for the diamonds over the um, the research and the gold down even further you're skipping the ox meat uh, you know, wash stones versus the badge chest. Now, here's something a little bit different. The wash, you know, you this one's guaranteed for that you're going to get some kind of badge, whatever it may be. The wash stones you're just going to use over and over again. So, are you going to use them and, and they're done? They're they're gone. So they're not uh, they're not sustainable. So um, it's nice to have those. They are a little bit rare in the game, but you do get them every time you uh, you know you're uh, you're in the expedition beyond. So I would suspect this this is the the case where I would probably get the badge chest. Uh, coming down further, these uh, damage increase um, for your rebel leaders are nice too because you can use le it helps you use less motivation to kill, say, a level four, or level five, or even a three, depending on you know where you are in the game, and, and then you also have 30 hours of speed up. So between these two, I, I, this is I, this is only temporary, as is this. Um, actually, all three are, but I would I would suggest going for something that's a little more rare, which is those. And then we go down here a little further. Again, I'm probably going diamonds there. There's 1800 as well. Um, going down further, you have a three-day truce or honor banners. Honor banners are a little more difficult to get. Um, you do buy them every day in the VIP shop compared to the three-day truce, which would be, um, you know, it, it's nice to have, you know, if, especially you want to be bubble 24-7, um, and a three-day truce is nice to have, but just, I, I don't know. I mean, it's, looking at the cost, it would have a cost for each one and what's what's more and what's less. I believe this is like 3,500 diamonds where these... Um, I want to say these are maybe like 1500 or something like that. So value-wise, this the three days is probably better, but it's what you need, you know. If you're if you're if you're able to bubble up with a 24-hour, uh, you know, bubble every you know every day, then there's there's less need for this, and these honor banners are more valuable to you. Moving down further, you get another um, just one more 30% there, or the diamonds. Now here's a case I'm probably going to take the diamonds because I'm getting 2,400 diamonds out of this one. And you also have there you go. You get what do you get? Three of these. Yeah, so that's 45 hours. Speed ups is actually pretty nice as well. But again, you get those speed ups all the time. So moving down further, you're not going to want the bow one. And then here, you know, the spirit of the weirwood, you, you still get plenty of those throughout the game. So I'm probably going to go with the speed ups in that point. Down here further, there's my epic token. I'm definitely getting the epic token here. You don't know what that badge is. These are like these are expensive, like 2,800 diamonds or something. Um, so you're definitely going to be getting those. Down further, another epic token. You know, and they entice you more with increasing these. So I mean, if you're trying to finish a research, I, c I can understand wanting to get you know uh, three days here, or you know, was it 15, 70, yeah, 75 hours? So th three days here as well, a little over three days. So um, that's also something. Uh, to consider as well, and then you go down further. We have the uh, the attack badge. Oh, we have common one or uncommon one. So that's basically four attack badges. Yeah, you're get, you're grabbing that for sure. Down further, 50% uh, summons. Those are expensive. They're either VIP. They're 2,500 diamonds. So um, you know, and then at full price, they're 5,000 diamonds. So those are really nice to have, especially if you're a zero castle that you know fights often. So that's you probably use these 50 percenters all the time. Uh, I'm, I'm getting motivation on this one. Oh, maybe, actually, maybe I'll get the diamonds. What's 648? Yeah, I may get the diamonds here as well just to try to, again, buy those tokens, those, those epic tokens. And then you get four precise transfers or four days of speed ups. Um, and again, this is based on kind of, you know, if you fight a lot, you might you want these precise transfers to move around. If you don't fight a whole lot, then you probably want your speed ups here. And the very last one, it may, it, this this one is a little more difficult because you have the honor banners, so they're giving you ten honor banners, and but these these epic and only one epic token you ho or epic uh, yeah epic token you would hope that they would actually give you more as you go down because you remember the ones up here that we had you know they give you one here and then they give you one uh, you know even before that too so you want um, the epic tokens are, are are nice to have but if you're if, I mean looking down at these. It'd be tempting to take those to take those honor banners um, as well. You 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 can only get the you get there are certain ways to get epic tokens and there's um, certain ways to get honor banners too um, for a relatively uh, I say low cost but a a, a decent cost uh, depending on what you want. But um, that's going to be up to you if are you you know if you're uh, this one token is that going to help you or these extra ten honor banners going to be a little more valuable to you. So it's based on what you you know kind of what you think, but. Um, that I'm glad that they increased the rewards here. They hit it a little, you know, a few months, few months ago. I hope they continue to do that. It's 
kind of get some of this, you know, kind of the, get some of the crap that's in here that's out too, like this ox meat. You know, you get plenty of that with your dragons. Um, you don't really, uh, really need that, you know, too, too much too. So just something to think about. But I hope this video helped you with uh, just kind of choosing, uh, uh, you know, picking what you what you kind of want and what you want to want to avoid when it comes to the alliance mobilization. And um, you know, get in there, get your uh, help your alliance out as best you can. And uh, until next time, Mac out.